Hello everybody, my name's Karibro, here with this guy again. What's this guy? Who are you? I am have been and always will be Josh. Right, how'd you get in my house? Uh, I showed up for Shantae again, and you weren't playing Mario, so I said, let's play a game dev taken. It's still not out, and we're <laughs> still so sad, and Alan is out of the country. Um, which is odd and out of the blue. I didn't realize that was gonna be a thing or he told you <clears throat> and you were just so frantically busy You forgot. I don't think he's ever told me before <laughs> Regardless, yeah. uh, we can't do Super Paper Mario for next week because we have extra life this weekend So we're doing this instead <clears throat> And we're in fact not going to be DJ and Associates. No, nope. that's his other save file that auto loaded for some reason We're playing game dev tycoon game and I paid for it. So it's not the hilarious pirated version I've never played this, but I've kind of always wanted to because it seemed like it might be fun and crazy for a little while. It well, is. Welcome to Game Dev Tycoon. Business simulation, transporter back in time, start your own game dev, 35 years, dream company, best selling games, fan leader of the market. Cool. We're going to make Honey Pop. That's going to be okay. our fucking, our like end of the rainbow dream title. I know if you make like <laughs> stuff like Bethesda stuff, like there's little achievements for that. <laughs> for mimicking. You start your adventure you have to give your upcoming company a name okay so we're doing there we this go. we're doing this in like a really stupid way because i didn't think of it and i don't think it was intended either but josh has the keyboard and i have the mouse yeah <laughs> so company name <laughs> scroopy nerpers scroop scroop scroopy scroopy nooper are you serious right now <laughs> Uh, I mean, I was okay with it. I'm just making sure that you you will say it out loud and be aware of what you're typing. There we go. We are Scroopy Noopers, and we're run down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's cool then, I guess. Let's be the female game dev uh, leader with the name of Scroopy Noopers. That can't possibly go wrong. It's... Oh, yeah? I, I've never... The black sure. female <laughs> Why does game hair have dev to be company. Long? Game length, 35 years, advanced options, cool. With this terrible thing. God, who would wear She's such got thing? like a sweater vest thing. Uh, and you play the game before you can choose to use all previously gained hints. Uh, would you like to import? What the hell does that mean? Uh, basically, <clears throat> I've played a lot and I've learned what combinations work well with each other. Okay. So this would be giving you hints that things work well together or not. Do we want that? That sounds like an unfair advantage for Scroopy Noopers. Then the that rundowns. sounds like a no. <laughs> Develop new game. Yep. Are we starting in a goddamn garage? Yeah, with a DeLorean. Ugh. All right. Okay, we should probably pick. Do we want to go name or topic? This is the first one, and the, the 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 name is the first line. So you start, and then I'll pick a topic to match. Uh. First. Fancity. <laughs> First fantasy. <laughs> We're gonna make, it's not our final fantasy, it's our first one. We're gonna make I, uh, our first game with it a- It sounds like a dance. With a goddamn typo on it. It is? <laughs> no, no, I, I was gonna say that first fantasy would be kind of funny for that. Uh, I will not spell anything correctly from now on. First fantasy is gonna be a space game. Uh, RPG! RPG, Tons. of course. On oh, the shit. G64. I don't know. Because that uh, that's the way of the future, man. The G64, it ain't going nowhere. So now we can give it sweet 2, 2D graphics, but that costs uh, like twice as much. Well, we can't have a, a Final Fantasy with text based. It's our first fantasy. <laughs> we can't have a first fantasy with text based. It's not a fantasy if you can't see what's going on. Don't you think they should remake it with 2D graphics later? It could be like our our like ten year anniversary game. No, I don't think so because then you can you can just upgrade it from uh, NES to SNES. All right, boom. We're gonna start big on our first fantasy. Okay, sweet. Now Look you, at those bars. Yeah, now you get to adjust <laughs> them, and she'll work on them accordingly. Well, we are obviously going to be a very well, cinematic. If it's RPG, you gotta have a lot of story. Cinematic based story thing. The engine yeah. the engine can kind of lack in a uh, RPG. That's a good point. Good point. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, gameplay. Yeah, right there. We yeah. want to make sure that it's got something engaging for people. <laughs> and then uh, she makes all these little orbs. That engine took about five minutes. <laughs> oh, sweet. Second part. Development stage two. All right. Uh, let's get dialogues and level design like almost to the top. And then F. Whoop. Artificial can be like next to nothing or nothing. <laughs> 
Well, that's next to nothing. Okay, it, it just yeah. means that we're not putting any extra time into it. <laughs> no extra. The pirated, they released uh, free copies of this game on like torrent sites. Yep. And, uh, oh, world okay. design, graphics, sound. <clears throat> Selected features. Basic sounds or 2D graphics? No, oh, that's, wait. That, that's what we already have. Ah, so we can't turn this off. Okay, no. so did we want basic sounds in our first fantasy? Yeah, that'd be like beeps and boops. Beeps and boops are important. You yeah. need you need that satisfying <laughs> when you kill a thing. Yeah, <laughs> and I don't know how much world design you can get. I don't. I, I'd say keep it all average, except for me. Now we're gonna max out world. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the pirated version. Uh, you could never beat the game because people would start pirating your games, and you'd lose so much money you couldn't stay afloat. So. The Wait, long, are, are you talking about like the way that this, the game actually works, or yeah. in our in our first fantasy uh, uh, fictional setting? No, they released uh, a game uh, on torrent sites of this that had a pirated. Oh, of Game Dev Tycoon. Yeah. Oh. So if you pirated it, you pretty much got the pirated edition. Cool. Scroopy Noopers. She got a little better. But isn't that is that a good thing? That's in yeah. red. No, I think that's like her. Like the other things are like. Your personal design. experience? Yeah. Okay. Release the game. So, first fantasy. God, I really wanted it to be called first fantasy. <laughs> uh, the first, when you're done uh, designing the game, mm -hmm. they'll sit and work out bugs. Disappointing. Fuck you, Star Games. World design? Oh, yeah. there we go. It, Thanks, informed it's gamer. It's a very informed opinion. Thank you. Game Hero is okay. Game Hero knows what's up. Meh. All we games. made this in our garage. You know what? You know what? I think I don't. I don't think we should give review copies to Star Games anymore. Oh, they've they've proven unreliable. <laughs> yeah, they're buying their games from now on. <laughs> it's just released their first game, first fantasy, moderate response. We're curious what we're under in the living room future. Nice units. Okay, you can click on the screen now. Just... Jesus Christ! How many? Nice. How did? What? That's a lot of floppy disks. Because <laughs> if this is supposed to be like, oh, like oh. these graphics and stuff. Ah. Okay, new game, Any game history. Uh, do we want to make a new one or research some stuff? Uh, maybe pop out one more game. All right, sure. Game two. Uh, what are we making next? Remember the direction that we want our company to run in towards the end of our life cycle. Yeah. Boobies and bejeweled. Boobies and bejeweled. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh man. How do Pressure's I not make on. about Shantae now? <laughs> Go ahead, go ahead. Make 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 it about Chante. Oh, the 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 stream was uh, giving me giving me guff too because I I say it as uh, Chante instead of Shante, and they were telling me I was wrong. Now I'm all self conscious about it. Did I spell that wrong? Probably. Chanty Pirates Hearse. Nice. <laughs> Pick topic. Oh, we don't have platforms. It's dance. Yes, right, yeah, that's true. She she is a belly dancer. Even though Pirates Hearse uh, has taken out the belly dance. It's a dance mechanics. action. Hmm. I guess it is kind of an action game. No, no, wait, action is. Action is. Hmm. I think this is gonna be a strategy dance game. Okay. We need to pick pick your dance moves accordingly. I'm really starting to feel like not having the uh, hints on what genres work well together is starting to <laughs> bite us. And this one's gonna be on the PC. We gotta get a game on both platforms. Okay. This one, however, can be text-based. Good. Can't have a dance game without text. <laughs> So we already we spent money on our new game while we're still making money on our other one. <laughs> the story in this text-based dance adventure. Yeah, that's everything. Uh, all right. Uh, all engine. Yeah, we Max we, it all out. Just make it all good. He <laughs> <laughs> <Everything> says. <laughs> we'll drop down on the story on this one. Okay. I'm I'm just clicking random ass buttons. I don't know if this is really what we should be doing. Maybe hints would have been a good idea. It sounds like we're gonna need AI. <laughs> yeah, we, well, it's a text-based adventure. How much level design do we really yeah, need? Yeah, dialogues, it's text. No story, but plenty of dialogue, because, I mean, you, you gotta have good, vibrant characters who are bringing your uh, virtual dance studio to life. Good characters with, like, no plot. <laughs> uh, graphic, text-based. World design can, uh, we can say see you later. It's all text. That's true. That's true. 
But that does mean that we should turn up the sound. Oh, we'll... yeah. Dance. Actually, yeah, we'll just have really, really good music in this one. Yeah. I think we got it. So there's one bug. Yeah. So after they're done, we can wait and they'll work out those bugs. Ah, yes. Finish. I see. Experience gained. N nice. That's a lot of technology. 1.5, new, to new topic, new combo. What did we get as a combo? Uh, Probably the dance strategy. <laughs> <laughs> Graphics, sound, God, look at all that experience. Release it! I've never trashed a game. The first reviews for our newly released game, Chanty Pirates Hurst, have came <laughs> in. <laughs> oh, I saw some big numbers oh! there. That's why we don't give star games anything. It's asshole bitches. See? Solid In force. Informed and coming strong with the informed opinions once what? again. What? Game Hero, come on. We are a new studio and we need you to be kind to us. Like our text dance games. <laughs> uh, yeah, might as well research now. We got money coming in. All right, sure. A uh, new topic or a custom game engine? Well, if you click on topic, it'll actually give you a choice. I think topic is a good one. We, God damn it. I, why isn't fashion detective one option? How are UFO and aliens two separate topics? Yeah, I don't know. We should probably make our next, our second fantasy. Uh, about aliens. Yep. Start research. Cool. Game off the market. Yep. That's pretty good, right? For a for a game that got a four, right? <laughs> Monthly costs. Hearse. It looks like we're losing a bit of money on Chanty Pirates. Hearse. So those uh, twenty-two research points oh, oh. is what we can spend on uh, researching new things. Cool. Research a new topic. So you can sit and just research a bunch of stuff, but then like. One will cost 50, we don't. We only have 22. Yeah, so let's get Most to- apocalyptic! Oh yeah. The Th kids love it. Third fantasy need to be, needs to be after the aliens. When uh, when, that, we, when we fail. See, we're <laughs> planning ahead. Come on. Man, Pirates Her sales drop like a stone. <laughs> I think it's because they played it. <laughs> Uh-oh. The governor is steadily outselling competitors in the PC sector. Oh no. Told ya. It's because we put Pirate's Hearse on the PC. Yeah, we that single-handedly killed the PC. That's actually why it didn't <laughs> work. All right, new game. What's next? So are we gonna keep working on our, our fantasy? Uh, yeah, I think we should make second fantasy. We, we need a sequel. <laughs> why did I make that a capital? Hard. Second or second or third. Third, fast dandy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, are we gonna pick topic? This one's gonna be aliens. Yeah. Yep. Uh, genre was again an RPG because it's a sequel. Pick platform. Of course, it's got to be on the G64. Well, it's what the kids have. So. Yep. Next, text-based. Uh, no, we gotta have those 2D graphics. Yeah. People think it's written stupid, but once they actually like get through the chug through the plot, a turd fantasy, <laughs> they really learn like that's an alien language, and it's like a deep cut Easter egg. Oh yeah. I think. I think we couldn't have nailed it any harder. We've already got a bug. Nice. <laughs> We're so early in development. I, all we've been doing is writing the story and there was like a, a fly that landed on our notepads. We're like, ugh, we're gonna have to wipe that off later. I accidentally put like a, a backslash and it just breaks everything in a, in a conversation. Pirate Source is now off the market. 25,000 isn't bad, right? That's more uh, views than I've ever gotten on YouTube. I mean, we didn't really spend a whole lot on it because it was text-based. Yeah. We made our money back. Yeah, it was cheap. Uh, artificial- It was on the PC. What do you expect from a dead platform? Lots of dialogues. Uh, we'll up the artificial intelligence a bit here. Yeah, aliens are smart, dude. We'll drop the, the level design. Because it's all going to take place inside of one giant spaceship, right? Yeah. But the thing is, we'll make the player really think they're on a planet. <laughs> and then it takes off. Uh, development stage three. Did we skip out on sounds last time? Uh, I don't think so. Wait, on uh, on on Final uh, Fantasy Pirates? Yeah. Is no, it the first fantasy. No, no, I don't think we did. Hmm, okay, so we'll leave that in there. But these are the last settings from uh, the dance game. Yeah. So we do need some world design. Oh yeah. Did, oh right, we did. We did actually leave sounds pretty low last time because we just no wait we but we did want the beep boops. Uh, yeah, we had beep boops. A musical score is like something we'll have to research later. Ah, this game diving is hard. <laughs> As you're just like moving <laughs> sliders. This is the hardest part <laughs> of designing games. Nope. Your bank count is in the red. That always happens. 
We'll be okay. Oh yeah. Just we we gotta work out these bugs and then our game will actually sell. Second or venture. Oh, we got an extra bug right at the end. Great. Okay, get ready to hit. Uh oh. Japanese company Ninvento. Uh oh. Shit. Dinky, Dinky gang. gang. <laughs> Take off. Well, okay, so we we need. Okay, you ready? Okay, finish. Yeah. We need this to go big, and uh, we can't really go home. We're already home. <laughs> New record, we're, our deving experience is off we're, the charts We're only here. getting better. Yeah. Oh, look our at that! Dialogue's leveled up. Can't be a rude dude, Graphics you got those dialogues. Sound. Sound! Look at all that personal experience. Scrooby Noobers, you're doing so good! She's really doing well. Mine's AK monthly costs, all right. Oh, I saw a 10! I saw a 10! Oh my god! <laughs> Star Games, you're back on the green list! Quirky, yes. we're good! Consistent! This, this is it, man. Come on. <gasps> Woo! Mm. And, Alrighty. uh... Alrighty, that's... But, but that's the best they've ever given us. Across the board, everybody liked this one more. For second, for, for turd fest ending. And only if it got people to go back and buy the first one. <laughs> Doesn't right. work that way in original. Um, so we've got a bit of time while we wait for these sales to come in. Do we want to research a new topic? Uh... Might as well, uh, I think it might be good if we just make an, another side game. Try to get that custom game engine developed. Okay, that's true. I didn't want to go too far in the red. Oh, yeah. But well, then, if, if, making if, if a second just, game If we just make, like, a those. second cheap one. Okay. Yeah. So, develop new game. What's this one gonna be? Oh, yeah? We have 37 fans! Fucking A, but I hit new game and didn't bring up the window. So, what do we got? Uh, are we launching a new IP, or are we gonna follow up uh, the Dex Dance Studio? You did Capital again. Dang it! I like Capital numbers. There we go. Perfect. Turd remixed. Topic. Got to be dancing. Mm, do we want to do dance? Uh, it's a remix. Yeah. So what was it? Aliens? Before? Maybe we remix go back it to in space? a spy game. Sure. Uh, uh, there we go. Perfect Darker. Dude, this is supposed to be a cheap game, though. <laughs> All right, well, this one, this one should probably be in <laughs> I think now we're just making a sequel to the game that we never made. Well, it's, it's more like, uh, it's like our Final, Final Fantasy X-2. Oh, kind of a sequel? On the PC. Because we gotta... <laughs> well, we're making more oh, throwaway. But do we... It's much cheaper. Yeah. But do we want to actually make this like a shit game if we're launching a new IP on this one? It's not really. It's we're we're launching like if the... if 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 Turd Fast Andy is doing as good as projections <laughs> say, I, th I think we're gonna make enough money that we should just aim for another big thing here. Because okay. I was worried that we were gonna go in the in the red like super low. Yeah. But between then and the thirty seconds it took from then to now, we made thirty two thousand dollars. Well, this is more like <laughs> in, it's in the it's in the turd universe. <laughs> it's not really the the next turd game, you know. Sure. It's like a it's like a Vice City. It wasn't GTA Four. But it's not just a follow up to the dance studio. That's no. what I want to know. Yeah, okay. it just borrows the the elements. So let's just go ahead and we'll go hard on this one. Just finish oh, your yeah? fantasy and impressed by your talent. Oh shit! Can you use skills like yours, short and cash. Let me know. All right, cool. We can do that. So I. Uh, mm. All right. So this one you're gonna need a lot of gameplay. Yeah. I don't know how much story we need. We just basically need to say this takes place in the universe. Oh, middle turd. middle on engine. Yeah. Wait, that was side quest, not story. Shit, side quest might. No, wait. No, it, it's like not side just side. Side quests come later. We need a solid main quest mechanics first. God damn. Nice. And it's still selling. Uh, we don't need that many dialogues. No. We'll, I think we, we have will to need work some on level, de level and, design. And AI, because you'll be fighting things. But did the original Doom really have much for AI? I d haven't played it. <laughs> it, 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 it did not. It did not. Well, it sounds like since we're just doing a, a basic graphics deal. Yeah. Level design is good, though. Because, I mean, as, as long as you have good level design, you can basically force the enemies to have to go through the path anyway. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, we'll need some good graphics. Some good sound. You need that blood splatter. World design is not. It's all basically that designed. We're, we're, yeah, we're just copying off of the existing world. Uh-oh. Recent rumors. That's okay. With how good these games are selling, we will be able to get in on the ground floor of the Ninvento. 
As soon as Turd Perfect Darker is done. 42 research bugs. Oh, All there's, right. there's, uh, we're still working on bugs. Let the bugs go down. It is not, oh, and we're getting a little more design. We're getting a little more polished. Look at this, 12 and 12. That's awesome. New topic and new combo. Look at this, oh. So many level ups, <laughs> those sweet level ups. Ding. I love how it couldn't be more of a system ding. Oh, Scroopy Noobers. <laughs> we're a better dev now. Oh, we're the creators of Game Dev Tycoon. Oh, this is. Yeah, I purchased the game. the game. You're welcome, Greenheart. All right, cool. Aw, this warms my heart. Cause I'm I'm the crazy cat. Oh wow, Jesus! You're welcome. <laughs> oh, All right, yeah? turn okay. perfect darker came in. Oh my god! I saw a ten. Uh, it was a flash. S oh. Seven. Oh yeah. Oh spy in action. That's what's doing us so good. Could have been. Oh, eh? that, that ten came up really quick. Nice. On sound. Show's potential. We're nailing it, nice. we're nailing it. All right, I think we gotta make one more and then we call this one an episode. That's like 6.5 on average. All right, we still don't have See, enough See, now to we get... can do contract work because that guy contacted us. But will that give us research points? Because we don't have enough uh, to make our engine. Go, go to contract work and I, it might just tell you. Yeah, look, help play test a game. You have to, you uh, have to earn those and you have to make 11 and 11 in five weeks. Okay. Or uh, you, have to pay them nine grand. But if do you we, do, it, we get that just by play test. Like, do we? So have you know to how when your thing? you know your person works on a yeah. thing and the little bubbles fill up. That's how, what she has to do. Work on that and fill those up in five weeks. So do we just leave it until she I'd, does this? I would. Yeah. Just I'd. You can hit uh, the side arrow and we can look for like lower numbers. Ooh, seventeen. <laughs> See, we don't know if she's a better designer or programmer yet. Ooh, that's pretty easy. One and nine. And it's just like, we're setting up computers. I guess, sure, let's try this. Make some side money. 15,000, hell yeah. Okay, so they do come up, cool. Oh, look, oh, it looks like she's way better on the tech side. Well, yeah, we'll design in just a second. Oh, and she did gain research points just from working on this. Oh wait, no, I, I know what it was. It was that you only needed one design point. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was what happened. There, oh yeah. Contract, excellent work, every six months, so check back sometime. Cool, let's make a new game. Okay. <clears throat> um, game five. Are we gonna make uh, Turd the Third? <laughs> <laughs> Turd from <the> first. <laughs> Great. <laughs> and I kept doing a semicolon, but you know what? <laughs> aim high, aim high before the Ninvento's <laughs> even out. We're gonna make a universe game that's actually not the universe. Because it's post-apocalyptic. There's a lot of Romans in the in the turd universe. <laughs> uh, another RPG. Str what? Not a strategy game? Are we not gonna make another like build on our RPG? For oh, for turd, it's yeah. action RPG stuff. Well, it's a universe. We could do adventure. We haven't done adventure yet. I guess. I mean, if you want to take us down that path. Okay, so it actually tells you like the market share of each device. It's been a while since I played this. I still like it though. Now that I'm playing it again, I'm like, ooh, I might have to take a break off Stardew Valley. Okay, so, uh, Turd Verniverse. Yeah, um, yeah. Engine is probably big for an adventure game. That's, mm, yeah. Be because you've got, like, adventure games generally come with inventory management. Yeah, I get you. That kind of thing. Crafting. Yeah. I can't believe I'm so immature. I just came up with two RD. Because <laughs> I'm like, second, no, no, let's do third. And I still typed to two. <laughs> It's great. It's great. We, we've started a franchise. Uh, Post-apocalyptic adventure. Um, I think we'll need some AI in this one. Not maybe mid on level creeps. design, creeps and stuff, and mid on dialogues. But I think the more complex we make things, the more bugs we get. But you know what? Ah, maybe yeah, we'll that would make sense. We'll work on this. Time allocation. Uh, if the universe game, we need a big yeah. world. The graphics probably don't need to be much. People are pretty. I mean, we're just aiming at like. If there's so here. much world, you'll yeah. be looking. You'll be looking at so much. They, they make you know it. What? They we've make it always themselves. been. We've always gotten credit on our sound. So, what are we called again? Rundown. Yeah. Rundowns about sound. 
but Rundown was... I built, really we, want to make a t-shirt that says Rundown Games Presents Turd Universe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the test came out, dude. All right, cool. So next game we make, we can uh, start on the, the Ninvento. My, my uncle works at Ninvento. Right, let's work on those bugs. Nice. Only 16,000, it's not great. Well, it's on PC. Like, come on. No one owns a PC. No dings. Uh-oh. It's okay. We got a new topic. The 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 post post apocalyptic adventure. For doing something uh, new, we did get a 1.5 bonus. Mm. So like, nothing ventured, nothing gained, sort of deal. And why do they have like pong taped up on their wallets? Of so dumb. The first yeah. reviews. <clears throat> what do we got? What well, we? This doesn't look good. What? Oh boy, they shouldn't forget about graphics. <laughs> <laughs> Did we forget about graphics? Yeah, we, we said that we didn't need a graphics because it was gonna be a world. Wow. Well. They did not like this. Jeez. Dude, uh, I told you we shouldn't have gone so big. We gotta focus on our RPG roots. All right, uh, so I guess that we'll start uh, developing our custom game engine. We'll, Finally, we'll work on this and then we need to we need to make an RPG. We need to get back these fans Yeah, look at her crush it on the on the thing. It's already had a pencil cup She has books. Do you remember books? You mean like those? Oh Wow, you have books. Yeah, I have books Successfully researched custom game engine game tutorial mono sound. All right, great. Nice so uh, I think we're gonna call that one an episode here because uh, we made five games. We've started the turd franchise yeah, and uh, and we we uh, we made our new engine to run on the Ninvento. Next time we come back, we're gonna start that. If yeah, first fantasy was our Cheers, mm. and the Turd franchise is our Frasier. It's much better, <laughs> but still needed that first fantasy origin. I, I guess I guess that makes sense. Click the like button <laughs> down below. Consider subscribing if you haven't already, and uh, check out my Twitch too because I do that uh, a couple times a week as well. Twitch.tv slash Curion. Listen to my podcast, bsjshow.com. That awesome. thing too, yeah. Go check out these guys. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do for the end slate this time because they came out with a new end slate engine on YouTube. I got a check option. That out. It looks really good, but it like it means that I have to totally uproot what I've been doing. So I don't know. Maybe I just won't put it on this one. So and it's then just, I'll just us talking with yeah. this still image. Yeah, and, I'll, I'll just uh, I'll just let this run, and then it will pop up yeah. with little subscribe buttons, oh, and wow. then like Look at another, that. and then another uh, playlist. Nice. Yeah, a be, whole it'll, playlist. It'll, huh? it'll be great. What is that? Multiplayer Madden? Oh, so, so, so cool.